Hi, I'm Exesis, and this is Hearts of Fine 4 by Blood Alone, where we're playing the Great German Reich with Expert AI. And uh, today we are starting to invade westwards. So the, well, we need to take these areas close to the US, and uh, I'd say we probably want to go down and take uh, some territories down here and uh, across the uh, Caribbean here. Maybe even Panama actually to just cut that off from them. Well, we'll start with launching these invasions and we'll pop down here and see what we can do. I think that would be, be a good area to have everything under control in. Uh, we do have a whole bunch of... Well, why are we losing some? Oh, we've probably got all of our aircraft still in... Uh, well, that was annoying. Uh, we need to uh, stand down a few of our aircraft here, I think. And close air support, let's stand them down as well. Stand down our strat bombers. Stand down our everything from there. We don't need to have these here either. And there we go. I probably don't need to be uh, doing this anymore either. Move them down to there. And there shouldn't be anyone actually coming in here either, so... And they're just moving down there, that's fine. Oh yeah, we did move these out to this source and we are expanding the airbase out there. Let's just check our construction queue. Uh, we probably don't need to have... No, let's finish the ones that we are building. We don't need this radar here in Holland either, actually. Uh, what we do want is to see if we can't build any more rocket sites. Uh, looks like we can fit one in here. Uh, we do want to have them very close to the top, I think. Uh, we've now got the uh, A3 rocket, so we should be able to put them up here. And that should be our territory. Oh, let's see, that's uh, quite a few rocket bases at least. Uh, let's send uh, this Aorus air base. Let's actually send all of these air bases up to the top. Rabant. And that should be fine. We've also got our six current ones. That's uh, question is if we want to let them stockpile up a little bit before we start our bombardment of the US. You can see the ranges there. Uh, the ones that are further eastwards here might not actually reach very far, but they should be able to reach the east coast here at least. I wonder if we had any ones we could put down in the Atlantic here. Now we do have a building slot here on the Azores actually. What are we using it for? No, we want to go to the source. There we go. We're using it for a military factory. Okay, let's uh, tear that one down. And uh, put a rocket side on the uh, source as well. That one should have very good range. Uh, another thing I was thinking of if we want to liberate uh, Ireland as well. We probably don't have that much to stop us with. And it should be something like a 30 day justification. 25 days, perfect. And we should be able to overrun them before any anything actually makes it there. Uh, let's uh, actually let's take our heavy bombers here. Let's move them up. It's a big airbase, and we can have them fly over England. And we don't need to have these over the channel anymore either. And there we go. And we also, uh, we can actually let it run for a bit here. Okay, so the fall of London here. Reports from London confirm that the English capital has been captured by advancing German troops. Small arms fire can still be heard from some boroughs 
but no significant British forces have been sighted within the city. A detachment of Hanshem's Jaegers have stormed the Buckingham Palace, but it is believed that the royal family was evacuated well in advance of the attack. For the first time since William the Conqueror, London has fallen to a foreign invader. Another victory for the fatherland. Uh, yeah, we do need to find something to do with everything here. Uh, let's uh, bump up two more floating harbors there. And bump them up a little bit in priority. Oh, we've actually got loads of them now. I think we could split them once in half here, maybe. Should be fine. No, we got so many military factories from England there, I don't even know what to spend them on. We got, and we don't have aluminium, so uh, Air Force is probably not what we want to spend them on. Yeah, let's uh, convert those. We've got a bunch of uh, tanks that we can convert. A bunch of crusaders. And a bunch of other ones. Let's uh, convert what we can. Uh, we can put uh, another few factories on heavy tanks. Let's double up the amount of heavy tanks. Let's uh, make sure that we have enough spare light tanks. I think we're still uh, replacing these. We have all the rubber in the world at the moment, so. Should be fine. Let's uh, up arm our infantry with better weapons as well. That right, should be fine. Oh, we're actually at a deficit of uh, armored cars, it looks like. No, we're not. They're just going for, to the garrisons. We got plenty of trucks. We got plenty of everything, I think. Except some aircraft types, but. That is what it is. Uh, we still got another 80 factories, which I don't know what to spend on. I think we're upgrading a anti-tank. Let's put some more anti-tank in there. I think that's enough for that. Let's make them into something even. We don't need more of those. No, let's uh, let's just leave them be there. Let's uh, bump the speed up a little bit here, though. We have uh, garrisons. and um, putting them into a separate army here. We are going to need to expand the garrison towards England as well. And I think we can probably use this army for that. Panama joined the uh, United States. London, of course. Wales. Okay. I'm not that scared of Panama, actually. We will make sure that they feel that we are are here for them. We probably need someone up here in Ireland as well. Port strike. Oh, shit. Especially those three submarines here. I wonder whether we must have been flying from here. I was hoping the Japanese would help clear this up. They're, they're not past uh, the Philippines just yet. Well, it will turn once we actually pop over the immediate submarines we've got over there anyway. So. I wonder how we're doing for the preparations here. Does look like they are all prepared, so let's launch these. And what we also want to do probably is uh, we can't really. Yeah, uh, we've based you back at the Azores, I think. But uh, I was thinking, let's split this task force up into four. It's one carrier and uh, actually all and a battle cruiser each, except this one that has three battleships instead. 
I think that's fine. And we'll use these as uh, naval invasion support. And they don't have any any regions set to operate in, of course. Now we're gonna need them over in these areas. So maybe down there as well. Uh, they drawn up here as well. I think that's fine. Submarines will handle the rest. And you are Corporal Infantry Division. You go up there. So you will use mostly this army here to operate in this region, I think. It would be nice if we were sinking some of their destroyers as well. Oh, uh, I just need to wait for all of these to pop over here. Oh, and they lost a the carrier down here. The Italian Navy of everything as well. And USS Randolph. And Brits lost three submarines there as well. Uh, Sweden, is Sweden is embargoing us. Not too worried about that. Should be. Uh... Oh, they actually popped out here to help. That's nice. We are rebuilding our stockpile of fuel again, slowly, slowly. We used a lot for the uh, air power here when we were invading, of course. Or two more heavy tank divisions. Let's put one in there and one in there. I'm going to want to have them all over here, Patron. I thought we had someone launching towards Iceland as well. We must have reassigned them to something else then. Yeah, that's not exactly where we wanted to have you. I guess we can invade from here. These four divisions as well. And I just standing around. Let's just make sure we have another attack then. I think we want to do a little bit more concentrated one down here. Because there's several ports, so we can hit them all at the same time. We could land here. And then we can take most of this island chain and we can use this as a staging point for the Caribbean. And we have an available war goal. And we have a potential... Why are they justified by Republic of China? That was very interesting. Where is the Republic of China? Is that all of the Chinas or... Leader of the Chinese United Front. And there we see. And they're actually quite big. And uh, they have a border on us. And maybe we take Ireland out later on. I'm thinking right now is not the, not the time to go into this when we want to focus on the United States. Fuel refining is finished there. Let's uh, just go down and grab the next one. When we're operating our entire air. Air Force, we are going through a lot of fuel. There we go. All armies are up to 16. Now we are stand here and threaten them for a bit then. And uh, launch those other two attacks as soon as you can. Oh, we actually got the invader trait here now. That's so nice. Now we're getting amphibious. So we get the extra supply grease. And we'll have to level up once to get the naval liaisons. And that gives us uh, invasion preparation time and uh, the actual speed of the invasions is increased as well. We'll see how well Denmark is defending Greenland. I 
think these should be the first marines to actually reach the shore. We don't have enough range to actually get up here, that's why it's saying so. They are defending with uh, two divisions, an American garrison division. It looks like we put a, another one there as well. Yeah, this, uh, this should be quite an easy win. We've got loads of soft attack coming in there. Don't really just to defend here for a little bit, I think. No, we can be on this one. That's perfectly fine. Build up a little bit of a planning bonus against them. And they've got no supply here, so they're just going to go weak, get weaker and weaker. We have managed to land here. Just to make sure that we've got someone guarding the port, and the others can cross. And then we should be able to take St. Pierre here as well. that way. That way. Maybe we don't need all of them there either. There we go. And uh, we've got three dockyards again. Let's uh, put some more uh, battleships in production then. I don't think we've got any new equipment for them. Or maybe a new radar actually. No, not even that. Put two Vandertan in uh, in production. I don't need that many convoys. Uh, I do need to import some more aluminium from Italy, I think. That should fix it. We're gonna need to garrison over here as well. And we'll probably set one of these uh, these armies up for that. Uh, this one should be fine. But first, we want to uh, add something into the production queue as well. Let's uh, no, let's upgrade the port here one level, here one level as well. Question is if we want to upgrade it even more so we can replace equipment up here. That's two good air bases. Don't know if Greenland's going to be any help of us from air bases, so we're not actually breaking through here. Oh, no, that's Finland who's invaded. Okay, but we're coming there to help them, so that should work out fine. Finland making a naval invasion, that's a that's a first. We're doing down here, Bermuda, yeah, no problem. What kind of port do we have in Bermuda? I think it's no, it's a level two one. Let's add another level here as well. We are gonna have a lot of aircraft station on these islands. Actually, let's let's just put them on maxing out. And let's uh, make sure we finish these rocket sites first. I don't think we can... Well, there's actually a few building slots up there too. Let's uh, let's tear this one down. We don't need a military factory. Over here, let's tear down the military factory. We only tear down one here. I don't think this one has any building slots. And we will add... Rocket sites there as well. And we still haven't arrived down here. We we are very soon. We should be losing submarines out here. They are flying uh, aircraft towards us. Okay, so these three here. First, we just uh, make sure they have no order. Uh, tell them to invade. 
down there. Let's get rid of the disorder there. And these should be... Okay, they're on the garrison order, I think, now. Let's send these down to... I got this small island group there. They need to launch from the same area. We just grab the next one in the chain. That should be fine. And two more up here. We can grab all of those when we land over here. And we do want to go in here towards Jamaica. I think when these land here, we can split off and take these two there. Oh yeah, Panama is not only this, it's all of this. That makes it that we need to make two landings, and maybe actually three, so we can take this port as well. But that's probably from the other side. We'll see where we can land when we get to it. That next one here should be Iceland to fall. want to start squishing them up a little bit here. It shouldn't be any big issues. We'll just leave one one defending here. And then we'll fall back around there. And it looks like it's an unopposed landing up here. Uh, that one will not be unopposed. We only got one Division over. I thought we had more than that. And you guys go when you can. I've got four more. Uh, these are the ones on uh, Bermuda, of course. And uh, pop down there. Why don't they want to be assigned there? After. We're forcing them to. And uh, I think we'll work with Kurikao. We should be able to land there as well. That's the Dutch. Let's put all of these on go. And they will as soon as they are prepared. I'm right. getting these in uh, multiples of four all the time. Maybe we should have set it up to make multiples of five. That's fine. So soon we should have all of these rocket sites set up at least. And we're building loads of infrastructure down there too. Get those rocket sites higher up. That military police will save us a bit of manpower. Let me grab the next one as well. That is a big one. I've got a rocket base around the Zors. And we are starting to collect quite a few of them. wonder if no, all of them could not reach here. And they can reach New England. And then we can do it that way. And we'll start bombarding a little bit here. We are targeting air infrastructure primarily. I think that's a pretty good start. We could actually add nuclear reactors there too if they have any that we know about. Oh, and uh, also we have quite a few operatives here that are without work at the moment. Why can't we put anyone further south?
And maybe we put one up here as well. I think we should be able to put one down in the southern states. We don't have one here in Washington anymore. Let's put two into Washington. That should help us build up a network here quite quickly. And we do need to set one of these into garrisoning our newly conquered territories. Only the ports are interesting. Well, actually, maybe the air bases as well. They're going to be the same in most cases. We're just going to have to expand it down here once we start handing and taking all of these places. And we got some tactical bonus down here as well. And we got U-boats coming in to repair it, that's not very good. And they're probably with air power. I can't see the one that we lost the cruiser submarine in. I don't think there's very much more here to do. I could go for the next level of reconnaissance as well. That give us a small bonus at least. Now this airbase should be built up. I can fly two of these into there. And we can start to cover these areas as well, I think. Oh, someone filled these air bases up directly. Oh, that's fine. We do have them in the construction queue there to be expanded. This is probably a good airbase to expand as well, actually. And the port. Oh, we're losing cruiser submarines here in the in the port. Let's build some anti-air there as well. Wonder if they're still bombarding us in the Pacific here. Let's just turn the. Uh, Repair off for some of these. And we'll do the same thing out here. And if we. Now that we have. If you control click them, you can make it so that your submarines won't go here to repair. Uh, that one would be fine actually. And Bermuda's gonna be fine. I think uh, these might be good to set the pair to not happen yet. I think we did some opposed landings here as well. Send someone across. Oh yeah, maybe we can go all across here. Let me just keep going up there. You can, yeah, you can keep going that way. And we need to send some marines to dislodge uh, the ones that went here. Uh, Iceland should be conquered by now. Uh, almost. Let's help them. I think we put this, uh, this army in charge of garrisoning. Finland can deal with that. Just make sure that we've got them all here. And not yet. Where are you heading off to? I think uh, this garrison order needs to go now. 
I don't want to have them shipping back home all the time. I want to plan an animation to there instead, I think. Set those to launch. And this one doesn't have anything on it anymore. That one should probably not either have anything. No, they've landed. Okay, so we finished night vision as well. Now let's grab some new radars here as well. We can get some longer range ones. Fine, I've got two standing around there. Let's make sure we've got everything here. Uh, it does look like we didn't manage to take her a cow. Where are you going to? You have to pop across there instead. Greenland offensive, okay, whatever. Oh, that one's weird. That one's weird. That one's already done. Oh, we don't need to have this one anymore. This one is anymore. I want to have marines over there, I think. I've got three marines here. I'll send them to there, where we have some opposition. That should be fine. Where do we have more marines then? Yeah, so the new ones coming over. Yeah, of course, we've got those ones here. We'll ship them across. I'm going to start collecting the hoops down here, I think. And these ones, no. And then these ones we have up here, yeah. Come all the way down here. Make sure that we can actually capture this here. There was actually someone out here. I'm gonna send them across to deal with these. Now you can probably pop in there below or behind. We should be able to delete that division. Yeah, there we go. Right. We can come back. Let's join that one. That should be the last ones up here. And these four divisions can start planning their assault on Panama. Can we land there? No, not really. There we can land. I'm going to send the marines in for the uh, main objectives there, of course. Okay, we can't really go to too many different places. Uh, this should be able to launch. This should be able to launch. They aren't in place, they are. Should be able to as soon as they actually arrive there. 
Garrison. Garrison. Oh, and the rest go in there. As the reserves. There we go. And Venezuela we're not dealing with. Maybe we can actually invite them into our faction. We got a good opinion of them. Let's uh, increase their opinion of us then. Uh, they might want to. I also want to prepare an invasion here. We should have these items covered as well. Yeah, don't don't be repairing at these ports close to the US mainland. Repair out here. They should be able to reach us there, but with any efficiency. Okay, let's uh, get a rescue operation going. Assume the mission afterwards. Let's pick one. I think uh, that one is already done. Now we can take these towards Panama. Where are you? You are preparing. And you don't need to go there anymore. Okay, so we've got all the infantry equipment now. 1946, midway through. We could grab that one too. Let's grab some more of the anti-air techs. It will help us out just a little bit. I want to edit this one. Yeah. Remove that one, since we already own that tile. And uh, we'll have to land here instead. That should be fine. We've got the last one here, yeah. Let's send them off from... We're on this one. Okay. I'll remove that one there as well. It feels like we don't have uh, everyone in base down here. But we do want to land on all of these ports at the same time. You're back in Normandy. That was a weird place to be. I captured an operative. All right. Okay, we'll see where everyone ends up. of you and you and you right. increase submarine production just a little bit we don't have the dockyards for it so why not what are holdings down here doing there's a lot of convoy raiding going on. It looks like everything is fine down here. Oh yeah, Siam got ripped up in the peace deal. Uh, I've got submarines out here. Okay.
Let's uh, launch this last wave and we'll see what happens here. I don't know if everyone is in position, but I um, guess we'll find out soon enough. And down here we probably want to build some airfields as well. Okay, we are building the airfield down there. Uh, maybe we can reach some from here. Uh, doubtful though. And there are a few building slots on the islands down here if we go through and remove some of these unnecessary factories. And now we've got three slots already. Good. And we can get one down here. Let's, let's keep the oil refineries. And let's put in some rocket ramps down here as well. That's good. Let's uh, see how we're doing here in Panama. Let's use those there. Make sure that we take that. Panama has capitulated, giving us not a lot. We'll keep on going here and we'll push the Americans out here from here too. And we want to set this up to our garrison. That was uh, not that hard. That prevents the EUS from moving ships that way. I want to go with one there, one there. And it looks like it was undefended here completely. Now, which is good for us. And Kurokao managed to take Kurokao as well. Or did someone else get. Oh. Oh yeah, because we've got them as a, a puppet, of course we liberated them for them. And we managed to sink some of the uh, remnants of the Dutch Royal Dutch fleet. Well, there's still some Americans left here. Or maybe they landed just now. And we'll have them wiped out. Panama could be a decent location to build up some air bases in as well. And the Netherlands capitulated again. And maybe we want to have a radar station somewhere along here as well. Close to the US of course. And this is already level 6 one that we captured. Oh, I could do with one there. I already have a really good one up here. But that's fine. Air bases. I want to build up this one here as well, I think. Let's build up that one too. And we can stage our aircraft here and we can move them up a little bit faster if we need to. Or when we need to. I would, I don't know if it's better for us to build up the... Uh, no, we'll just launch our invasion from Europe across the, across the ocean. I think that's... Fair enough. We can uh, remove uh, this one there though. And here we should have lots of free slots. Let's uh, remove a factory. And in here, there's no slots. No, we need to remove even more if we're gonna actually do something there. I do want to take this one though. Walking into the rainforest here is painful. I can probably remove that order as well. I 
I should have air superiority here. I got some friendly aircraft. We don't have our aircraft, but let's keep attacking. You'll get through eventually. Just uh, hang around there for now. Oh, I should be moving in there. Good. I can hold all of these. Actually, let's uh, let's get them up to the, the ports on the Atlantic side. I'm just going to remove this line there as well. And it should be them all unassigned. Good. That means they're all in position. Look at Finland. I don't think this one's going to go very far. The Americans are going to come and push them out from there. I do think we managed to grab some new rocket silos. Let's make sure that we are using them when we can. should all be going there. I don't know if we're actually doing any damage here though. Yeah, we're damaging at least one building there. Uh, somehow they are managing to shoot them down, but um, very well then. I think we've got a few more territories to add to the defense here. And could a cow. Might as well. Alright. Very good. Uh, no, we can't do all the airports. 24. So uh, I will need to actually invade the United States next. Or the uh, entire North America. But uh, that will have to be in the next episode. So thank you very much for watching. Take care. And see you next time.